What is going on guys? Welcome to Craigle's TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. We've got some huge news on the Pixel 2, the smaller version and the XL or whatever they end up calling the bigger version. Now, the smaller version, let's talk about that. XDA got some leaked specs from a source they highly, highly trust. They said this person's always right and he's very familiar with both of these phones. Let's talk about the specs on the smaller Pixel X 2. It's rumored to have a five inch display at 1080p. Now it's supposed to have a very similar design to this year's current Pixel phone. So you shouldn't see any huge major difference in terms of design on last year's phone versus this year's Pixel 2. You're also looking at four gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of storage, which is gonna be a little bit of a bump and a minus of a bump. So it looks like it's probably gonna be one version this year. The smaller version had 32 gigabytes, the larger version had 128 gigabytes of storage. And then this year, uh, it looks like the one that comes out later in October will have 64 gigabytes of storage. Also, one of the major things that's gonna be uh, in here, which is gonna go across both phones, will be a Snapdragon 835 which is very common. They're not gonna look like, doesn't look like they're gonna go to that higher 836 like was rumored at one point. So a Snapdragon 835. And then the other big thing, and this is, might annoy some people, is they're gonna remove the headphone jack, but also they're gonna include stereo speakers now. And this is gonna be on the cheaper, smaller Pixel phone, which is kind of, big time because they don't do that on a lot of phones anymore. So you're looking at, again, I'll just re rehash those specs, a five inch 1080p display, four gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of storage, Snapdragon 835, and stereo speakers, no headphone jack on the smaller Pixel 2. And on the larger Pixel 2 phone, you're looking at a 5.99 inch OLED display, so it's gonna match the same display more or less quality-wise as the new Samsung phone from their Galaxy S8 line. Also, it'll be 1440p, again, same as last year's uh, resolution on that Pixel. Four gigabytes of RAM, 128 gigabytes of storage. Fingerprint sensor will be on the back, and then the camera lens on this phone, and I would assume it's gonna carry it over both, is only gonna be a single lens with a single flash. So you will not see dual lenses on the new Pixel 2 phones, which could possibly be a big disappointment to a lot of you. Now, if we talk about this, and we'll go rehash the Pixel 2 specs one more time to make it a little bit easier to follow. So you're looking at Pixel 2, the large one, you're looking at a Snapdragon 835, four gigabytes of RAM, 128 gigabytes of storage, a 5.99 inch OLED display, a single lens camera, and the fingerprint sensor on the back. Now that we have the Galaxy Note 8 specs coming into light, along with now the Pixel 2 and Pixel 2 XL uh, specs coming to light, I think it's gonna give you a, maybe a better, clearer idea of which phone you wanna end up getting. Now, just to give you a little, I, I just got this HTC 11 today, and I can say right off the bat, I'm, pr I'm loving it actually so far to the point where I think I'm gonna sell my Pixel phone just because you know the Pixel phone's almost a year old. I need to get rid of it sooner or later, especially with the new phone coming out. So I'm happy enough getting this HTC 11. I will have a video on this one, unboxing, first thoughts, things like that. So that is actually my first, I really like this phone. It's really, really fast. And it's got this very similar specs in between wise to the Pixel X2, uh, Pixel 2 and the Pixel 2 XL. So that might be a great alternative to you as well if you don't wanna go the Samsung route. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below about the new Pixel 2 and Pixel 2 XL. Is it still a phone you think you wanna get? Is it now not a phone you wanna get? Let me know in the comments down below. That's your question of the day. I made it easy for you. Also, if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Thank you to my Patreon supporters. Yeah, yeah. Patreon link is listed down below. Also, get a t-shirt, guys. I got t-shirts for sale. Check out this guy. Thank you. He, he tweeted me out. Anybody that posts, uh, uh, buys a uh, t-shirt of mine and posts it on social media or uh, it tags me or emails me, I will definitely repost it on my social media and share it on these videos. So if you get one or if you already have one, shoot me a picture of you wearing it. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you down the road. Peace.
Guys, if you didn't see yesterday's news video, make sure you check it out. It's always important to check out the tech news if you missed it. The video below that is a video I released earlier today on the Bionic Action Grips, Quick Shots uh, Grips. They're like 20 bucks and they work with Xbox One controllers and they allow you to get better grip and shoot faster. So check that out if you're a gamer. If you're not subscribed, click my head.